Revelers and Wanderers of the Forest, welcome back. I'm Deciduous DJ. Today we are trying something very different. This is Northern Journey. I picked this up in the recent Steam sale. Um, the reviews I read of it uh, sound very promising. It's apparently supposed to be very atmospheric, very pretty landscapes and environments. And we're all about that here. So I figured it'd be a good sort of interim game to give a go uh, while we're waiting for Immortal Empires for Warhammer. Now, this is a blind playthrough, so I haven't even hit new game before. Um, so this will be me going in blind, um, and it'll be in interesting to see what uh, what this game actually holds. So, from what I know, it's a it's a retro, semi-retro FPS uh, made by a one-person dev team, which is pretty impressive. Um, and yes, excellent sort of lighting, music, mood, atmosphere, all stuff that I really value in a game. So, without further ado, let's uh, dive right in. Okay, I mean, you can already see the sort of retro style. I can do is move the mouse at the moment. Boat's filling up with water. Can't swim. That's great. It reminds me of um I don't know if anyone's ever played Gothic. It's like an early RPG. It's giving me similar vibes. I mean it's, this is pretty though, I will say. That is Oh, interesting. So... Cannot save while interacting. Alright, no worries. So five is quick save. Okay, here we go. I like the music. Yeah, that, um, the field of view is very reminiscent of, you know, Quake and things like that. Let's go see what this place holds. It's, it's really pretty. Uh, it's got the similar kind of, like, even though it's low res, it's got, it's not the same atmosphere as Valheim, but it's got that same strength of atmosphere, despite the, the low resolution. Which just goes to show you don't need, you know, fidelity to make something effective. <laughs> okay, good to know. Well, let's do that. Can I... Okay, I'm gonna rebind. Quick save. Can I not change it? It doesn't seem so. Okay, fine. I wonder what that zero up the top is as well. There's another three down the bottom. Is that my health? I had three health. Zero is probably ammo, ammo or something. Hello. Oh my god. Okay, that's a person. I thought it was like a a bear or a badger or something with human arms. Okay, three things have been stolen. Alright, let's move away. How do I get my journal? Maybe J? Ah, oh, convenient. Alright. Talk to priest in church. Big rock. Okay. Yep, that's what I just did. Uh -oh. Is it 
zombie or something. Hello. Am I about to get wrecked? Is that a snake? What the hell? This is wacky. Uh huh. Cool. All right. Sorry. Sheriff's place. Tree shape key in the lighthouse. Was that? I saw the lighthouse before. I think. I think we part. Did we pass that on the way down here, or is that? Is this a tower? Hello. Are you an angry dog? Sheriff? Okay. Hello, can I talk to you? Hmm. Okay. Sheriff plus prisoner. Where's this prisoner? Oh. Oh my god. Well. Hmm. Alright, so this is update anything. Okay, no, it's just removed that item, so I guess we just have to talk to the sheriff. Alright, so we got priest in the church, big rock on the trapdoor, mother and daughter, tree shaped key in the lighthouse. Alright, let's start over here. Hello. Ah, <laughs> oh, this person's in the stocks, okay. Hello, you're a priest? No, it's a doctor. Ah, uh, yes, doctor. <laughs> well. I don't know what that did. Oh, that actually gave me 25 health. Cool, nice. Alright. This game is like, it's slowly getting started. Hello. Man, why are these people so creepy? Hi. Uh-huh. Ghost of the Witch guards the key. Wonderful. What about you? Can I talk to you? Ew. I don't like that at all. Okay, so I don't have the key. Can't go in there. I'm guessing they'll probably get mad at me if I do. But, okay, so let's remove that quest. Reason the church. And maybe then after that we'll go to the lighthouse. What does this say? Lighthouse this way and forest, maybe? It's like a tree symbol. Let's go find this priest. That looks like it's up here. And even the bell. Like, it's, it's supposed to be a bell, right? But it sounds all kind of synthy and weird. What are those things? Hello. Oh my god. Okay. Is this going to be a jump scare game? Is this going to walk through me? Hello. Uh-huh. Yeah. Alright. Sure, I'm sure it is. I need to get out of the way. Okay, I just picked up some health. Bell tower key. Okay, you can jump pretty far. Um, alright. That's what's left. Big rock on top of a trapdoor by the church. Alright, let's see. We're near the church now, so let's try and find that. Is this it? Okay. Not strong enough to remove it, huh? 
Got to say, it's not making very encouraging sounds. Just another health potion. Oh, another one. Lighthouse, I guess let's go for the lighthouse. Okay, this door's open now. I guess we've done the sort of tutorial bits. Hello, see you the same person. Right. Okay, so we're gonna get a weapon and we're gonna get a key. Let's go to this cavern first. I am liking the vibes. Hello. Looking for the inventor. Prefer not to fall to my death. Well, I guess we're going to cross the creepy bridge. Okay, I'm going to save. Got to remember to save. Okay, so health potion is H. Ah, okay, that's what that number is. Cool. Flasks. Good, good. I don't know, have I found the inventor yet? Is this the inventor? Okay. Cannot save during interactions, wonderful. <laughs> uh-huh, okay. There's an elevator. This. Tab. Okay. Click weapon. Let's put that there. down the bottom center that's okay so I can only wind it up for so long before to release the rock this takes us where back to the lighthouse what's up here anything interesting they seem to be quick saving a lot oh okay nice that's handy cool Is there fall damage is a question. I don't know. So far there hasn't been. Alright, let's figure out what we're doing. Wait, why am I interacting? This thing? Hello. I'm still interacting apparently. I want to go to the lighthouse. Okay. Tab. Yes. Target nearer, target further away. Well. Oh, I can't save. Fine. So it's like right click to wind it up and then left click to actually release. Let's see how we go. Probably die a lot, but that's okay. Yep, 
Yeah. Got that. More health potions. I'm going to leave that one there in case I need it later. Can't save. It's annoying. Ooh, oh my god. That is a gigantic freaking spider. Cool. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh boy. It seems like there's gonna be a lot of bugs in this game. hear things in my headphones. Okay, good stuff. Can I save now? Yes I can. Alright, let's go back and get that health potion. I don't know how um, how frequent these are, so get them while we can. Hopefully get some better weapons eventually. Emergency flask. Wait, ah, oh, we're back at the church. Okay. Hmm. Is there a map? No. Nope. Oh, there is a map. Kind of. I don't know. I assume that'll fill in as we travel. Okay, so we want. We want forest path gate. We probably can't get stronger until some plot thing happens or we find some item. So we either search for a crack, crank for the elevator, or we go find the lighthouse, which I think is... Yeah, excuse me. I think that's what we want to do, but I've lost my way. So let's try and get to the lighthouse. That can be our first. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Well... <laughs> That's one way to do it. Okay. Click load. <laughs> Alright. Let's try not to do that. Are we going to fight these things again? No? Okay. I saved after I fought them. That's good. Um, cool. Where is the lighthouse? We don't want to fall off any cliffs. See, I thought I saw signs back the other way. Or maybe I'm mistaken. Because yeah, that's the church. Let's carefully go down this path. Maybe this way? Let's get to save the old ground for the sake. Well, so far this is interesting at least. It's just pretty to just be in and walk around it. Huh, fair enough. Well, I guess let's, let's take its advice. Ah, good to know. So it's best if you wind it up. Even with the sling, there's like a surprising bit of depth. Okay, hello. Is this the lighthouse? Need to push ladder down. What did I do? Where did it go? Hello. What is happening? Great! <laughs> That's exactly what we want. 
Cool. Alright, this is the ladder. Lighthouse is this way, so we're gonna go this way first. I'm supremely paranoid about saves now. Well, the terrain is so precarious, but look at that. Look at that view. Okay, clearly, that's a bridge then. That thing hanging off the tower. We'll probably lower it down. Do that at some point. Uh, what is over here? Is this the elevator the guy was talking about? The one that's missing a crank? Is this just gonna kill me? I wanted to go to the lighthouse, which feels like it should be up and down. It's certainly taking us somewhere. Okay. So clearly this is a different elevator, and I can't go back up there now. Cool, 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 cool. What is over there? Something glistening. What is this? Hello? Crossbow box. I don't have a crossbow, but... It's good to know. God, I wonder if I've done things in the wrong order. Should I be down here? Oh, is that the lighthouse? Okay, never mind. So oblivious. Okay, good stuff. There's nothing in here that's going to eat me. Looks like a lighthouse to me. Let's lower this bridge. Okay. What was I actually looking for here? Tree-shaped key. Is this that looks like a tree-shaped key? Thank you. Forest path key. Wonderful. I'm glad I don't have to backtrack all that way. Where is it? There. There you go. Water run. Okay, well, that's nice. Just saves a bit of time. Instead of me having to hold down shift. Am I about to be chased by something? Who knows? Alright, so I've got a key to the forest path. You know, I'll open the gate and find a crank for the elevator. Well, that first one feels like kind of the main quest. It's down here. Is that the elevator they're talking about? Maybe. Oh no, we came in here, didn't we? Yeah, okay, this is back to the this is the first path we went down. Right, gotcha. Okay, slowly figuring it out. It's interesting, I've been playing for what? 25 minutes now? And there's only been one combat. So the game's taking its time to sort of get get that going. But I guess it's not just a you know hack and slash type of thing. It's a bit more exploratory and thoughtful than that. Which I like. I'm certainly enjoying it. Ooh. Oh. Okay. That looks unfriendly. Hello. Are you gonna kill me? No? Ah. Right. Okay, message message from the travelling flautist. So we're gonna go find the village idiot. And 
That is Jenny. Alright. Hang on, wrong way. The town's over this way, isn't it? Alright, let's find out what the hell is going on here. Hello. You need to get weirdly close to these people to initiate the interactions. Hmm. It almost sounds like a fairy tale. That's what that sounds like. Um, that doesn't really give me... God, should I be, like, making notes? I don't know. Well, <laughs> it's not going to tell me again. Uh, something he wrapped in his pants. And then the other one he wrapped in a sock. So he's got one in his sock, one in his pants somewhere. And I can't remember the other one. <laughs> Man, I don't know. Maybe I should be, like, writing some of this stuff down. Um, hello, you gonna help me? We're full health, so... Right, alright. Ooh. Okay. It's half hoping that's gonna open up into something. Alright, so... Let's see if we can find this forest path gate. Otherwise we go back to the cabin. And see if we can find a crank for the elevator. Hello. Do you have anything to say? No. It's all the same. Hello. There's nobody in here. Saving. Got a number to save. This bridge is very narrow. Not a fan. Let's go find this cabin one more time and see if anything comes of it. Okay, so you're missing a crank. Okay. Is this where we went before? I think so. There's nothing really here anyway. Okay, that was a sign for the forest, so let's go follow that down this way, huh? Alright. If we can find the forest path gate... Oh god. Okay, I've got to really be mindful of the, uh, the physics. The, uh, movements have a bit of momentum to them. Okay, forest. What? I'm not in an interaction. Am I? Still am, apparently. Alright. Guess I'm crossing this bridge. Map draw. Nice. Is that a... Okay, so we unlock the first little bit of the, uh, the map. It's neat. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I was wondering if they were um, enemies, but they didn't seem to, to be until I approached them. It almost reminds me a bit of Dark Souls, the original Dark Souls with the Dark Rick Garden. Come on. Take all these guys down. Okay. Hopefully we get a better weapon soon. Okay, forest path gate, here we go. Save. Alright, and I think with that door open into the woods, I'm going to... Yes, thank you. I'm going to call it here, um, and we'll pick this up next time. This is really to be a very interesting, interesting start. So, 
Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.